Hey guys, welcome to Friday Favorites. I do this every week and this week is an important week because it's a little bit different. I do have a few favorites, but I wanted to make a couple of updates. So next week is Christmas. We're going to be out of town from Saturday until Monday. So we have not vlogged at all this week. We have been so busy because I got a new office and it has a filming space in it. So I'm excited because um, starting probably January 1st, I'll start filming at the new place and I won't have as many interruptions and all of that. So I'm excited about that. So be looking forward to that. And then, like I said, we've just been crazy busy this week because of the holidays and um, we're going to be out of town next week So or this week weekend. So the only videos that are 100% going up is tomorrow I will have my swap video with World of Karoo um, go up and then on Wednesday, Christmas Day, probably later in the day, I'm going to put up our Christmas vlog. So it's going to show all of, you know, us out of town this weekend and all of our Christmases. So I thought that would be fun. And I'm also going to try to film the All I Want for Christmas tag and put that up on Tuesday. But we won't have Mommy Monday because the vlog will be moved to Wednesday. And then I won't do, I probably won't do like a getting ready with me or anything. But it's just going to be a crazy week for everyone. So I figured I would let you guys know what's going on with my filming schedule. Something's wrong with my throat right now. I don't know why I feel so funny. Also, if you're new to my channel, I have two giveaways going on that I will link below. Actually, the shirt I'm wearing is from a girl that is collabing with me. She's given a $50 gift card away in the giveaway. So be sure and check the fashion one out and the naked three one out. And I'm going to get into my favorites because my battery is blinking and I've got to head out to meet the inspector in like 12 minutes. So, um... A Batiste dry shampoo. Oh my gosh. This is the sassy and daring wild one. And this has saved my life this week. I'm getting my hair done today at 3 o'clock. So it's a mess right now. But I love this dry shampoo. Um, another thing that what I have on my eyes today. I have been obsessed with these L'Oreal Infallibles again. And this one is in the color Infinite Sky. And I'm telling y'all. These are so amazing. So I put this on my lid and then I used the Elf Baked Eyeshadow in, what is this in? Plum, Burnt Plum. And I put this in my crease and these two together just are so beautiful. So there's those two together. It just gives a gorgeous eye. Like I said, it's what I have on right now. I love it. My camera died and I had to charge it. So that's why I have a necklace on now. Anyways, um, okay. So the next thing, I actually picked this up at the CVS clearance. It was 75% off. And it's by Physicians Formula Eye Brightener Natural Eye Light. And I love this. It just comes with this one single shadow. I'm going to get y'all close so y'all can see. It's kind of, okay, so it's kind of like mosaic. I think. I think that's how you say it. And there it is. What I use this for is just to highlight the inner corners of my eyes. Can you see it right there? It just gives a really pretty brightening effect to your eyes. I really, really love it. I also use it on my Cupid's bow to kind of highlight that area. And I've been loving that. I think I paid like $2 for that and I love it. I've been using it almost every single day. And then the next thing, oh my gosh, this is so awesome. It's the Revlon blush in Wine With Everything. It is so beautiful. It reminds me of... Um, CoverGirl's True Plum, and it also reminds me of Max Melba, I think. I'll have to see if it's a dupe, but the one thing, it's not very pigmented, but you can build it and make it so beautiful. You can either use it like really naturally, or you can build it and build it, and it's so pretty. I love it. It's gorgeous. It's right there. It's so pretty. Been wearing this a lot this week. Uh, it's what I have on today, actually. And then um, I mentioned this last week, and I had only tried it for a few days. But the Physicians Formula Eye Booster Eyeliner, obsessed. I don't feel like I will ever go to another eyeliner in my life. Like, I love this. It's a liquid, but it's one of those soft, like, I don't even know what you call it. It's not like a marker, but it, so it makes it easy to do 
like your wing and everything and it stays on all day long I love it it's supposed to be like a two-in-one eye serum or something I don't know about that but I have been loving that this week and then um, the real techniques powder brush oh my gosh y'all need this seriously I've been really I've been using this over my um my Sigma one so um been loving these I love real techniques blushes anyways or brushes anyways but this powder brush is the bomb okay and then for my lips real quick um all right I know I'm late on the bandwagon for the Revlon just bitten kissable balm stains or whatever these are called um but I picked up a few I picked up two a while back and then I got this one in my swap that will be up tomorrow and it's in the color honey oh my gosh I have worn this I'm not even kidding every day this week seriously and then to top that off with the Maybelline color elixir I think is what these are called the elixir and this is in petal plush this combination I'm obsessed with I have it on right now I just I really really love honey okay this is like my favorite lip product from the drugstore there are those two. This is the um, Revlon Color Kissable Balm Stain, and then that's the Maybelline Elixir. Love those two together, and that's it for my Friday favorites this week. Next week's Friday favorites, I'm going to do the Best of Beauty 2013, so it'll be my yearly favorites, and that will be next week. I will see you on my next video. Bye!